Hey, welcome back everybody. Um, today we are working on a Honda TRX 90. Uh, this is a 1998 Honda TRX 90. Um, picked it up just a couple weeks ago. it up a couple weeks ago for not a lot of money um but uh I'm wanting to get it running and, and get it out there and let somebody enjoy it so uh been working on it a little bit uh, got it running really good it starts right up on the first pull um so that's uh that seems to be good to go right there um has just a little bit of smoke. Uh, the tires are right now getting redone. Uh, I got brand new front tires and brand new rear tires. Did the um, Deep Stone 929s, the knobbies for the front, and the Carlisle, Carlisle Timberwolf for the back. Um, they were interesting sizes, not super common. The rear was 19 by 8 by 8, and the front was a 20 by 7 by 8. Um, so not a ton of choices out there. A lot of people switch these over to run different rims, different tire sizes. It's got a 4 by 85 bolt pattern. Isn't that right? Four by eighty-five. Yep. So four by eighty-five on the bolt pattern for the Honda TRX ninety. Um, but today's video, uh, I can show you it start off. scare the puppy dog um, but it, it's really you just flip it to run and pull it and it starts so um, seems to be running good uh, just a little bit of smoke but yeah, it could just be burning off old oil in the exhaust um, but got a, a new air filter for it. It came today. Where did I put it? There's the filter. It's hiding over here on this really ugly seat. We're waiting for a new seat cover for it. But they don't make these seats anymore. You can't even buy them. Not even really aftermarket, so... Uh, we're going to recover this one. I got new foam and new cover and everything coming. So I'm going to redo that and uh, make it look brand new. But today we are putting on a new air filter. So it's going to be the Uni NU4127ST Honda for the TRX90. It's for 1993 through 2018, and this is made in the United States. They claim it to be the best filter on earth. 
I seem to buy a lot of them, so I like them. Um, I did have a warranty claim, or I guess they don't really honor any warranty or whatever. But I sent them an email. I had this one. And it split after only a couple months of use. And um, I haven't even got it dirty enough to clean it once. Um, I mean, I guess I could clean it, but, um, so I put some glue on there to seal it back, but it basically split from one side to the other, and I was not happy about that, and I sent them an email on their contact us page, and they have not sent me anything back, so not super happy about that, but it glued back together. Uh, but today we're going to oil this one up and get it installed, so I'll show you how to do that. Alright, so first thing we're going to do is take the seat off. Once you've got the seat off, you're going to undo these clamps. Two here, and then one there, one there, and then this box should lift straight off. Once you get that box off, yours may or may not have foam around this core, um, but ours does not. Um, so we're going to pull this core out and, uh, and put that new foam around it. Uh, it's a little hard to do one-handed, so I'm going to undo this strap right here. And, and pop this out, but I can't do it with one hand. And out it comes. So you just you pull that tab forward, down, and it slides right off. So good to go. I'm just going to clean this up a little bit, and then uh, we'll be right back. Alright, so we've got our filter. Open it up. I always send you some cool stickers. I guess not super cool, but they're uni stickers, so that's cool. And then there's your filter. Uh, this is going to have the inner yellow layer that's got the smaller foam and then the, the outer layer. Just like the regular filters, you need oil on the filter. I'm going to just take it and spray it down. So, got it good and sprayed down, set it down, let that soak into it for a few minutes, and then we'll, uh, we'll rub it into the filter material after it sits for a few minutes, and then once it's uh, rubbed in, we're going to transfer it onto the insert, the core, some people call it. All right, so I just washed this off with some gasoline. And got a little bit of the particulate out of it. So that nothing gets sucked up into the carburetor and into the engine. Uh, it's got a little bit of rust on it right there, but Nothing on the inside, the inside still looks good, so. So this filter, I'm gonna get wrapped around that. 
been on there for a minute or so. We're just gonna rub this oil in to the filter. Give it a little massage. Make sure it gets spread all through the foam. A little bit more. Feels good and well done to me. Alright, so here's your core. Up, over. And through the woods. This is where we're going to go once we get this on the full row. <laughs> no. um, so just pull that around. Guys, we've done this before probably. Stuff it in there. Got it all tucked in there nice. Got it all, all sealed up good. And then it all sort of tucked in. Looks like it's all tucked into me. Got it all tucked in around there. All tucked in on that end. So that looks really good to me. Got our little uni, uni filter now. All good to go. Let's go put it in the bike. I'm gonna put this in our TRX. So there's the hole, and there's the little flange. That little flange is going to go into that little hole. I'll try to do this one-handed. See what happens. So we're going to tuck that flange in there, run the clamp, push it, swing that little latch around so that it looks like that when it's all finished. You're all set. All right, so we got our filter all installed. Off camera, I spun that around. Um, you know, I bought the Uni filter. That way I can see the Uni name. Uh, whoever buys this uh, can open it up and instantly see it's a Uni filter. Probably put a Uni sticker right there or something. But uh, the one that comes in the pack, or I might put it right there. But I'll definitely put it on the back of the, the box nothing else but four wheelers look good with stickers on them usually so I'll put that on there um, but this box just goes back in these tabs all folded out it sits down in there clip 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 and there should be one more clip. Uh, where'd it go? There it is. Clip. All right, so those are up in there. Right there. And right there. Right there. And right there. And so that's about it for right now.